Hey guys, welcome back. So today we are checking out all the things I have been loving for January 2019. If you want to see what I've been loving, just keep watching. Okay, I'm going to start with what's on my lips and I have been loving this. Now, <laughs> this is pretty new to my collection, but the minute I put it on, I realized it's like my lips, but better. So I was super, super in love with this. This is the e.l.f. Beautifully Bare Satin Lipstick in a touch of nude. Now you guys, by the time you've seen this, haven't even seen me haul this yet. But I have already, like... Like, look at it. Like, I've changed the shape of the lipstick already. Like, I've been using this every day since I hold it. But not by itself. Because I'm really loving this, like, glossy look. So you could just imagine what I'm using it with, right? <laughs> I am still very much in love with the Buxom White Russian Gloss. And that's what's on my lips. So I'm going to give you a quick swatch of both. So that is the color of the e.l.f. lipstick and then this is white Russian beside it and there they are together at the top. So for sure my favorite pair right now. They're just, it is my lips but better. Next item is uh, my body lotion that I have been obsessed with. I got this during the 75% off sale uh, that you would have seen. I'm not sure which one, but this is the Frosted Coconut Snowball Ultra Shea Body Cream. 24 hour moisture from Bath & Body Works. I... Oh, I just love the smell. This is supposed to smell like frosted coconut, North Pole vanilla, and snow-kissed woods. I love this. I love this so much. But my cat hates it. <laughs> if I, like, I'll get out of the shower and I'll, oh my god, so excited to put this all over my body because I love the smell of it. I put it all over my body, my cat's out of here. He's like, nope, too strong for me. So I like it, my cat hates it. <laughs> Next uh, fragrance item is this bad boy. This is the Sol de Janeiro Brazilian Kiss Body Fragrance Mist. I have the smallest amount left. I'm like basically at this dotted line. Oh, I love this so much. I have the lotion, I have this, I have the bath bomb that I haven't used yet, but I'm so very excited to use. I think it'll be amazing. Ooh, I can't wait. <clears throat> Alright, let's get into the makeup products. Well, actually, one more thing that isn't like makeup makeup. This. The Clean and Clear Soothing Eye Makeup Remover Oil Free. This has been like, it's the oil and like water mixture that you shake up and then use this has been a lifesaver to take like to just make it that much easier to get the makeup off my face you know work this first get all my eye makeup off and it's much easier to get the uh, face makeup off and not be left with like smudges under the eye and stuff so this stuff's awesome and I've already gone through like a half a bottle really love that stuff I guess there's one more item that isn't makeup but it's like a makeup thing this is a Sephora um, sponge. It is so soft and so good. Like, I really, really like this sponge. Yes. And it works so well. It, like, it gets a little bit bigger than this when it's wet, but not too much bigger. But it works so well under the eyes and to, like, set under the eyes and stuff. I, I, I just really like this one. On to the makeup. Okay, so buttered bronzer. I have been really liking this, obviously, for bronzer. But for the most part, 
um, I've been wearing really simple makeup and I've just been taking this and putting it through my crease with like a big fluffy brush. Just taking it, piling it through the crease, putting on some mascara and maybe a little liner and then that's like it for the eye. So I've been really using this to death for that purpose. When I use concealer, I have two concealer products. This month I fell back in love with this. I hadn't used it in a really long time, but this is the Erase Paste from Benefit, number one in fair. So it's like a peachy concealer to help with darkness. And I've really been liking this, and I've been using it with like a small flat brush like this. Not this one though. I don't know where it went. It's somewhere in there, but really been liking this. And then to put over top this one here, the Tarte Rainforest of the Sea Aqua Sealer. It's been nice and hydrating and my skin has been so dry. I need like a really hydrating concealer. So I really love the coverage. I love how hydrating it is. I love the applicator. The only thing I hate is the smell. It just smells like straight up paint. So other than the smell, this thing is amazing. For a primer and a setting spray, I have been using this, the Smashbox Photo Finish Primer Water. I haven't really been using it as a primer, just as like a setting spray all over my face. And I'm nearing the end of this, so. But I really, really, really did like this a lot. It's really good. Makes your skin look really good and really helps all your powdered products to set. I have been in love with a blush, which I haven't been in a really long time. And it's an affordable blush too. This is the e.l.f. Baked Blush in Rich Rose. So it's this beautiful marbled um, blush. And I'm just going to give you, you can barely see it on my finger here, but it's just this nude blush it it's just what you need you know it it's light I have it on right now it blends beautifully and it's like a warm almost bronzer blush kind of thing I really do like it a lot a lot a lot so I've been using this every time I wear makeup this is the blush I'm using I'm not using Okay, my last product, I don't have a foundation that I've really been loving or anything like that, and everything else is basically the same, but oh, I finally, you know, got into this. I was holding on to it and just not wanting to use it just because it was so beautiful, but then I decided that's a stupid reason and <laughs> you should use it. You spent money on it. So this is the Anastasia Beverly Hills Amorese Highlight in highlighter <laughs> okay here it is there I haven't even taken off like the plastic on the mirror you can barely tell I've been using this I have this on today right there but here it is it's just it looks like an ocean of gold it is freaking beautiful let's swatch it bit more to my nose. Cupid bow. Oh yeah. Like look at look at that highlight on my nose. Like oh my god. <laughs> it is like it is everything you want in a highlight. It's a bit more extreme on my nose though. <laughs> but it is just beautiful. And I love it so 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 much. <laughs> And yeah, that's it. So I just have, you know, the, just a couple normal kind of esque products and then a few beauty things that I've really, really been loving. I'm hoping to get back into the favorites videos. It's been a really long time. But I'm going to get back into it. I'm going to try and set up a schedule Monday, Wednesday, Friday. 
and make sure I have a video for you guys. I'm really working real hard on it. So hopefully you guys are liking it and this is working for you guys. If you have any suggestions for videos you'd like to see, let me know. And uh, yeah, give this video a thumbs up and I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys.